Hi, updates are underway. Thanks for the patience, everybody. Oh, <laughs> yeah, okay. So this is Tower Balls in 2020, and there's nothing new. This game is abandoned, quote-unquote, because it, I say that very loosely because the last update was August 10th, 2019. That was the last update. It is going to be almost an entire year. It is, it is about nine months since the game was last updated now the game is updated it was yesterday last night but there's nothing new it's i don't know what planet was doing he just may have done that for a fix or something but just never publicly talked about it no idea but uh yeah there's just tower in 2020 yeah the game the game is kind of dead here are the games side by side i have it on my on my favorites and tower defense just really crushes the game i believe tower defense simulator has um more visits overall overall so tower defense simulator has 382 million and tower balls has 340 million yet tower defense simulator has only been out for <clears throat> about about going on for a year i think although it didn't release until like september or something like that because i remember playing with below uh when he first made this game for the first school project and uh yeah <clears throat> i think it was around i think it's around eight months old or six and it's performing a lot better than this game that's been out for about three years i forgot how to do a deck where i would um play solo it's been so long since i bought her to play this game oh since i have tower balls up i can list you all the towers that tower defense sim uh, simulator copied uh scouts sniper Farm, well, farm, I'm actually going to leave out. Uh, not really soldier, because they're too different. Uh, patrol, for sure. Zed, yes, Zed. Oh, yeah, yep, they, for sure. DJ, yes, sir. Oh, Commander is literally a copy. Commander was literally a copy of it. Oh, my God. God, they need to steal barracks, though, because that's because that's uh, a fun tower. And uh, they also stole the Golden Towers ideas as well. These were pulled from tower balls. Oh, and I still have Red Scout given to me by my planet. So that's it's sad how this game kind of died. And like I, I, I kind of was a big YouTuber. Well, I guess I still am because nobody really makes vi makes viz on this besides uh, Josh Mash, I think. But he's <laughs> he didn't upload for the entire month. <laughs> oh, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, the sad thing is that YouTubers that did a lot of Tower Balls videos, when the game stopped getting uh, updates, so did the YouTubers. They stopped making content. Much similar to me with um, Arsenal, I guess, except like it's usually going to be one per month, so it's not as bad. Plus, I do some other content as well. Wow, all these maps suck. BRB. Crap, I just accidentally joined the uh, better version of Tower Balls. Ooh! thing that sucks about this game is that um, you can't choose the map you want, unlike in Tower Defense Simulator. Now, in Tower Defense Simulator, you can't exactly choose, but at least you have some choices, like 20 of them. Tower Balls, there's only three, and you gotta waste your entire time rejoining servers. And man, look at that quality. Yeah, that's the, uh, I think that's Roblox lag. Although, I have seen things that Planet is planning to add to the game, and it is a good amount of content, but... I just think it's a really terrible idea to make it all in one. It should be spread out. Um, but that's just me on it, I guess. I think uh, Borderlands is the best match just because of how long it is. Western is pretty good. But um, Borderlands is probably better. My channel somewhat grew up on Tarballs for a bit. I was doing nothing but Tarballs content for a bit. And then I moved on to eventually Arsenal, I think. And I mean, like, I... I never really wanted to stop making content on this game. It's just that there was nothing new to do. And that's why I generally... That's pretty much the reason why I left. It's just because there's not enough content. And a couple of YouTubers decided to stay and their channels died pretty hard. If I just stay on this game, I think my channel... I don't think I would have 300,000 plus subscribers. But I definitely do want to support this game still. It is a de uh, definitely a game I still uh, I still want to a hundred percent support. Uh, only with new content. I'm not gonna try and think of like uh, original ideas like I did back then. 
I think Tower Defense Simulator still copies Tyrells because the zombie, the zombie uh, wave layout is still the same crap. Oh, I forgot about those farms. Got his bits. No! See, the thing is, is that the farms work per wave, and in Tower Balls, there's like a 10, no, like a three second wait time uh, when you get the money, and then the new wave starts. So, in that, in that new wave time, you can put down the farm. And then upgrade it for more cash, and I screw and I screwed it up. But uh, now I can manage, I think. Oh, hey guys, fun fact: I spent twenty thousand robux on this face. Oh, wait, I'm pretty sure I can glitch. Yeah, I spent twenty thousand ro uh, robux on this face, and you can't even see it. So uh, yeah, that's a good use of twenty thousand robux. I know I'm a wise investor. No need to shame me. Uh, how I got that robux was a from a tower defense simulator trailer, and I also got it from Ben uh tournament. And I will be getting more from uh, uh, other sponsored sources, yes. Uh, Allie would do content on here as well, but she mostly moved on to Arsenal, I think. And Tower Defense is similar. At least she should. I'm like, Tower Ball is just a dead game, man. I'm like, that's that's what it is at the end of the day, un, un, unfortunately. Because compared to Tower Defense similar, this game is nothing. Uh, and that's the sad thing is that Tower Balls was here first. But unfortunately, Planet stopped caring to release new content. Uh, he says that college got in the way, but I'll be real with you guys. Uh, Below Natural, he deals with high school stuff. And he has pre-EP classes. That's that's probably just as hard as college. Except college is probably, e probably a bit easier just because the school hours are a lot less. And I have seen the work in those pre-EP classes. <coughs> 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 Oh, I have seen them work in those pre P classes, and uh, I say it's about as hard, if not just a little bit less ho less harder compared to college work. And Below Natural still manages to pump out new content. Of course, Below does have a a team, well, kind of a small team. Um, he has a side guy named Raz. He uh, co scripts for the game. Um, he does have map map uh, map makers, but <clears throat> those are not really uh unnecessary i guess but they do help on time and yeah i could see why tired of similar would pump out content more but my planet could just get the same deal with you know a new team and stuff like that but i don't think he wants to do that so that's kind of on him the one thing that tarballs uh has that tower defense do uh, does not is this little damage dealt like that is really helpful to see if a tower is good or not and, uh, hey, uh, Below Natural, if you're watching this, or Raz, dude, steal that. That is good stuff. Okay, about to get my golden commando. I just need $190. I could sell the farm. I'm going to sell the farm because uh, I don't want to ruin the placement of my little tier golden commando. Oh, I forgot. Stealth detection <laughs> costs 1.2k. I think it costs it, like, a grand at first, but I can't remember. It's kind of been a while since I, uh the game wow uh i didn't need to sell the farm i was a stupid move cool but there's a golden commando that's what got me known on tyrell's though is that when planet gave it to me and i <laughs> the reason why he gave it to me was solely solely because i went to sleep early that's literally the only reason why and he did it as a joke to give me the tower a ton of people were uh un ironically butthurt about me getting like an exclusive tower and i don't really care i'm like it's the same concept just like in um and uh arsenal yeah because i got purple team is only reserved for mods and there's like a bunch of butthurt mods and like uh fanboys that are not fans of me like uh mad at i got the purple team i generally don't care it's just a color but yeah that's what really jump started my um i guess fan base on, on here is because i was literally the, the only guy to have golden commando at the time and uh, eventually it got out to the public like you, you know all the players could uh, own that which is cool that's uh, that's so, that's something really cool because like these are some of the most overpowered towers in the game although the drawback is that they cost way too much it's really a shame that tower has kind of lost the uh, game war I guess because when tower defense when tower defense simulator first started off planet could have easily responded and uh put out a bunch of new content but he just didn't and tower defense simulator really took uh his place because it promised new content like weekly that was 
really cool new towers per week new maps new new stuff now i think it's more so once per month and there's always new events and stuff like that and um this game <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I have two golden commandos and I am really good in farms. I'm gonna be spamming a bunch of golden commandos in a bit. And uh cool, not enough cash. Seven dollars off. Thank you, planeteearth.com. <clears throat> oh yeah, I, I forgot about a DJ. Tower Fist Simulator stole that. DJs in here give a bonus of a fire rate. I don't think they do that in Tower Defense Simulator. And because DJs in that game, they give a bonus of range and also price reduction. This game does the same, but replaces the range with fire rate. Uh, it still has the cash reduction as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, so in this game, you can give your towers two types of um, fire rate boost uh, sources. While tower defense similar is only one and that's the commander. I just realized I bought the custom game pass, so I'll, I could just do this. Yeah, this is my jam. Thank you, Planet Earth. Yes, this is what I come back to. <laughs> oh yeah, motors in this game are really OP, because in Tower Defense Simulator, god, they are so garbage compared to this game. My god, like, come on, Tower Defense Simulator, you can copy the Golden Towers to be cool, but not, but not the mo but not the motor to be OP as hell. Sucks, man. Like tower defense, Scott. It's just, it's just so worthless. Tower balls is pretty OP. Once I get it to the nuke stage, only at max, it's really good. Other than that, it's, it's kind of poop, I guess. All right, this is the nuke motor. It has range almost of the entire map, and if you boost it with uh, like range commander or an tower defense simulator, it would be the DJ. This would be super OP. Oh, and this plane tower, it gives free stealth detection to all the towers around it, so I don't need to buy self, self, uh, self detection for him, and that's really cool stuff. Same thing with the motor now, he can see it. Oh wait, they can detect self already, so that's kind of useless. Cool, I got that weird stage thing. Uh, also, one of the cheese rolls fall off, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, we still win, but barely. Some other maps you would lose, because it takes so long to kill the void. 500,000 health, I think that's more than tower defense similar, I think. But yeah, I can still manage to beat the game despite, despite not playing for nearly a year. Wow, I can... I still manage to win the game and know the tactics properly, at least for the most part. Nice. Honestly sucks that Planner F doesn't really put out new content. Uh, believe me though, I, I, I have seen it and it's really good stuff. And in, ter in terms of quality, it's really nice. But honestly, he should not do it to the point where it's just one big new content. Because that's... That's not the right way to do it. It's better to do it in smaller waves. But yeah, it's just really un unfortunate to see this game fall. Not necessarily due to laziness, but just due to carelessness.